Alright, I'm at a uh, job today in the Southern Shire, basically doing a, another relocation of a uh, HFC connection. So as you can see here, you've just basically, because uh, like it's only 1.8 metres from this box, so basically they've just put a little bit of cable in, drilled through the wall and gone into his bedroom where he doesn't want it, he wants it in his office at the other end of the house. I won't do that. So this is where the points come through at the bedroom end here. As you can see it's in the bedroom at the front of the house. So we're going to relocate that right down to the back in the office. So hopefully this one's going to be pretty straightforward. So uh, what we're going to, some of the things that you use, we use a couple of bits of 20mm uh, grey conduit just taped together. Then you're going to tie your cable at the end of that. You're going to push that through the ceiling. Um, then we've got like a yellow tongue which we'll use to get up the cavity at the other end where the socket is, obviously your RG6 cable. We use a rotter sometimes, um, so you can put a hole here, push the rotter up to locate where the hole is, but we're not going to need that because I'll show you why. So here, on this job, customer's got no sarking. Once right, so that sarking is usually that blue protective layer that's underneath here, but um, we can get access upside down into the uh, ceiling from here. So we're just going to push our conduit through here and I'll jump up in the ceiling, pull the conduit all the way to the other end where I've got another tile off and then we'll locate it there and then we'll get it up the cavity and then uh, from here we're just going to run it down uh, external and clip it to the uh, box. So fun times. And uh, most of the time I will unroll uh, the cable in preparation so it easily feeds in through the roof. And I'm going to tie this to the end of the conduit, which is poking out here now. The end of the RG6 cable uh, taped with electrical tape onto the end of that 20mm conduit. So you've got to be careful up in the ceiling not to fall through it. I've navigated myself to where I can find the conduit. So if you look over there you'll see that. When you're up in a dark roof and you take a tile off, you'll notice that's where uh, the light's coming through. So you look towards there, you see the conduit, here we go. So now I've got to get right to the other end. Just keep pushing this all, feed this all the way along. So after a few minutes, I've managed to get my conduit. And if you see over there, I'll turn this off. You can see there's a light in the corner. That is the other hole where the, uh, I've taken the tile off there at the end of that ducting. So I'll feed my conduit over to that hole, I'll jump out of the roof, and I should be able to see my conduit there and then pull it through. And the cable comes It's through. also no fun when you're in the roof and your big light dies. <laughs> so luckily I've got a, a light on my uh, iPhone here, so I'll use that to get out. Look at that, there's my conduit at the other end. So I'm at the other end now. Uh, back with the offices. So that's the office just down here at the back of the house. Now I can just reach in, grab my conduit, and pull that out. And all the way through to the cable. And there it is. Coaxial. Front to back. And it's going to be enough to get down. Yeah, that'll be enough. And it looks like at the front end I've measured off the perfect amount. Good. So at the office end here, I've just taken off the uh, phone point. I'm going to push the yellow tongue up the wall, and then we're going to put a change it out from a single to a double, and then put his HFC on one, and then the phone back on the other. Bingo, yellow tongue, I'm not sure if you can see it. There it is popping up out through the cavity, so I'll just reach in and grab that. So now I've got the RG6 taped onto the yellow tongue and we're gonna pull that down to cavity to the socket in the office in the location where he wants his uh, MBN connection. Here we go. Here we go, new cable. The street side where we originally fed the uh, cable in for, we just drilled a hole just big enough for the coaxial to come down. And we've clipped it down all nice and neatly and over to the box here so if you're looking from the house side 
No, you're not going to see the cable coming down. The only thing you're going to see is just a little bit at the top. No, so that's hidden there behind the uh, on the duct. Got to dress and uh, apply the um, compression end crimps onto here, so we can uh, terminate it into the isolation device. Put the socket on the other end here in the office and we'll plug everything in. Yeah, we've got the uh, lead going in to the uh, HFC device here and as you can see we've got the downstream, the upstream, the online and the power lights are all on. Happy day. Internet lights yeah. on. Dial tone. Beautiful.